The Pacers started off strong, right out of the gate. Their defense was impregnable, and their offensive play was fast and furious. It was clear from the onset that the Knicks were struggling to keep up with the Pacers' pace. As the game progressed, the Knicks faced a major setback as they struggled with slow starts and defensive lapses. Key players like Jalen Brunson experienced some shooting challenges, which only added to the Knicks' woes. On the other side of the court, the Pacers were thriving. Tyrese Halliburton had an outstanding game, showcasing his skills and leading his team to a dominant performance. His contribution was instrumental in the Pacers securing a 32-point victory. The Knicks' defense suffered a significant blow with the absence of OG Anunobi, and this was evident as the Pacers continued to widen the lead. Towards the end of the game, the Knicks' starters received some much-needed rest, but the damage was already done. By the final whistle, the Pacers had secured a decisive victory, tying the series at two games apiece. This game was a clear demonstration of the Pacers' strong offense, defense, and the incredible performance of key players. So, what are the key takeaways from the Pacers' decisive Game 4 victory? First, the Pacers have shown that they can play a fast-paced, aggressive game and come out on top. Second, their defense is rock-solid and can stifle even the most potent offenses. And third, when their key players like Tyrese Halliburton are in form, they are a force to be reckoned with. That's it for today's breakdown of the Knicks vs Pacers game. If you enjoyed this analysis, don't forget to like the video. And if you want to stay up to date with all the latest NBA news and game breakdowns, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Until next time, keep enjoying the game.